Well, in just the past two weeks, not even counting the past three and a half months that I've been here in Shimokan, I've heard the N-word used more often, just in the past two weeks, than I did in Tacoma in the past 15 years. Even my neighbor. I remember uh, two months ago when I had uh, I had went. It was one of the was it two months, maybe a little less than that. Anyway, it was one of the last days that I was uh, going to uh, the external places to eat. You know, restaurants or you know a pizza place or something like that. I mean, it's a pizza here is pretty cheap as far as you know cost, uh, but. Uh, even there, I, there was this uh, the waitress slash bartender, however you want to put it, set up like a pub, but it's it's uh, mainly a, a restaurant. But they do serve hard liquor, and people hang out there. And anyway, I uh, she she came up to me. I mean, we were talking uh, a bit about hey, I, I've kind of liked it here. It's it's been nice. People have been kind. And, and then she came back over after she, she helped someone else, and then she said, well, I don't want to sound racist, but, uh, and then she went on, on a tirade. Uh, she said, those people, referring to black people, and she went on a tirade about uh, black people. And just, you know, so many places I've went, I, I end up hearing that N-word over and over again. It's really disappointing. And it's interesting how it seems to go... Uh, what do you know? It goes hand in hand with uh, Trump supporters. And I don't care how many people dislike my video because I said that. But uh, I'm sorry, those, those things seem to go hand in hand really well. I'm not saying that uh, if you support Trump, you're a racist, but I am saying that uh, most of the racists in this country support Trump, so. But yeah, it's just, it's just disappointing. And you know, whenever you hear it, you have to pretend you're okay with it. Otherwise, you'll become a target. That's how that works. That's how that's how the, the racism uh, thing works. If you if you try to speak against it, you will become a target. I don't want to be a target. Just let them have the, those beliefs and oh sure yes, and as I become more of a shut in than ever, it makes me not want to go to any of these places. So, I mean, even if they did have the, the, the smoking law passed, I probably wouldn't really want to hang out at a lot of places that are out here because of that mindset. It's, it's, it's just disappointing. It really is. I've <clears throat> went back on SL I'm going to be DJing in SL again really soon. Um, <clears throat> I've already acquired a lot of music to replace what was lost in that hard drive crash, so, you know. But I, I've... Especially after hearing the neighbor start using the word a bit, I, I I don't even want to go outside and, and do the walks or any of that. I'm going to have to. It's, it's good that I, I do that at night if I can. Because I need to get exercise. But, oh my god. It's going to be interesting when we start getting snow. I somehow didn't pay attention to the fact that out here, yeah, it's not three months of snow, it's five months of snow. That's how it works out here. 
Now luckily this room that I'm in now retains most of the heat, it seems. The heat rises, it goes right up to this room, it goes from the, the stairway right up, right up into this room. So I'm going to keep the kitchen and the living room rather cold. It's not like I'm going to have anyone over anyway, is it? Keep those rooms rather cold, keep this room kind of toasty. Even though it's still cool enough that I'm wearing a jacket and this hat. But, you know, try to keep the electric bill down. But yeah, um, this is not the place for me. Um, when I heard it again yesterday, when I heard the N-word used again yesterday by a neighbor and someone that uh, was just walking down the sidewalk and we started talking, you know, I, I decided that no, I, I I don't think I want to try to give this a go beyond the eight months. I, I, I'm kind of done with that. I'm, I, I guess in my mind I had the stereotype of, uh, well, the, the North is, uh, is not very racist and some of the Southeast is the racist parts of the country. Well, that might be, maybe there's still some truth to that, but, uh, uh, you can find this kind of racism just about anywhere. So. It's just disappointing, that's all. I'm doing alright. I have all the things that I need. Um, but I'm going to kind of be a shut-in out here. Unfortunately. Unfortunately.